I want to assure all Nigerians that we will continue to be a formidable force in the fight against smuggling and illegal importation of harmful goods. We will remain steadfast in our duties to ensure that our nation remains a safe place for all to thrive. The seizures that we have made today were done in strict compliance with customs laws. As smugglers refuse to retract their class against the peace and economic stability of this country, of operatives the of the Nigeria Customs Service are not resting on their arms until the menace of illegal importation of goods is reduced to the barest minimum. The seizures on display include one, a 40 footer container of 4,800 pairs. This quest is what resulted in the successful confiscation of 12 containers laden with smuggled military uniforms, tramadol, codeine and other illicit drugs. On Wednesday 4th September 2024, Comptroller General of Customs Bashir Adewale Adeni paid an official visit to Portaco River State where he conducted a media briefing and paraded the seized items. All these interventions have a duty paid value of a staggering 31 billion 200 million 688,142 naira to those who may be tempted to continue this kind of illegal activities. Let us be very, very clear with them. Nigeria Customs Service, in collaboration with other security agencies, we bring the full weight of the law upon anyone, any company, any entity, whether they are in Nigeria or outside Nigeria, found complicit in this crime against our fatherland. The CGC who lamented the prevalence of smuggling activities in the terrain announced the services major of declaring a state of emergency against the importation of illicit goods into the Nigeria through the port. As we move forward, I'd like to reiterate our commitment to continuing with this momentum in this port and indeed all other ports in Nigeria. Nigeria Customs Service, under my watch, will leave no stone unturned in our mission to protect the health and the safety of all Nigerians. We will strengthen our intelligence network, we will enhance interagency inter collaboration, we will ensure that those who seek to arm our nation face the full weight of the law. Concluding his address, CGC Adeni expressed deep appreciation to the officers of the Portacot Area 2 Command for their relentless efforts in safeguarding the nation. To the officers of Onet uh, uh, Command, the Portacot Area 2 Muhammad Bashir, NCBN, Abuja.